Oh, I thought my camera was about to die. Oh, stop. Why have I become... Oh, I'm going to the West End. I'm going to the West End. I'm getting some Starbucks. It's loud out here, isn't it? Hold on. Happy Vlogmas Day 7, everybody. It is 11.56. I am so tired. Oh, my goodness. So, I um, booked a hotel downtown because I have things to do downtown today. Um, and I was like, well, let me just, or, uh, I need to get a microphone. I hope y'all can hear me. I have things to do tonight and I need to be downtown. So I was like, let me just book a hotel. I'll get ready downtown. I'll edit out. Like, you know, I'm off today. So I was like, whatever. Y'all know, I just be booking. I just be staying downtown. I don't live close enough to the city. So, please don't run me over. But I have the right away. I know you're not honking at me. There was no way you were honking at me. Anyways, please hold. So, Madison, of course, drove to school, which means I had to get on the 640 bus. I get on the 640 bus downtown. I get down here around like 7.30, 8 o'clock-ish, and I go to the hotel. But of course, just my luck, the room isn't ready yet, which it's 8 o'clock in the morning. I definitely understand, especially if you had a busy night the night before. It's just, it happens. So I'm sitting, and I'm waiting. It is now 12 o'clock, and I decided maybe I should just go somewhere else because I now have, well, I mean, okay, I still have a long time. I have like seven hours still, but it's just like, I'm hungry, I haven't eaten anything today, and I was ready to take a nap once I got back, well, like once I checked in, and it's been like four hours. I was just sitting in the lobby. I guess I could have walked around, gone to like a coffee shop or something, but A, I didn't want to just spend a bunch of money, and B, I, I really didn't think it was going to be as long as it was. So now I'm just going to walk to a different hotel. It's about a 20 minute walk. I could have taken the train, but why not take the seat? But yeah, so that's the vibe of the day. I want to flat iron my hair today. Hmm. I want to do a lot of things. We can hang out today, honestly. Um, I'm just going to be editing and doing my hair, but we could chat. Oh, I'm gonna watch the challenge tonight with Zachary, so we can hang out. Yeah, well, and me and Hillary are having a meeting. Yeah, we have plenty of things to do today. So it's gonna be you and me, babe. You and me. But I will let you guys know when I get to the hotel. And hopefully to some better lighting. <laughs> and quieter surroundings. I'm back because I just did something really stupid and I hate, I hate pedestrians with literally every soul in my being and I was just, I was just that pedestrian because why am I trying to cross the street but my light is not green or white, whatever and the people's light, I'm thinking, I don't know what the heck I was thinking, that was so stupid of me, like everybody's going left and I guess in my head they're making right turns. So I'm like, you know, right turn is just based on availability. But I have the right of way. No, you don't. No, you don't. Why did I just do that? That is so embarrassing. I am so embarrassed. I want to follow that car and say sorry because that was so embarrassing. <sighs> just sad. I need to, I need a dry bar. This room is cute. Wait, wait, there's a lot going on. That light. There's, there's never light. There's lamps, but no lights. Well, let me show you the room first of all. It's a nice size. I look like a homeless person. Literally me walking around with this big bag. And it wasn't even that cold outside. I was just walking around like this with these sweatpants that don't even like. No. Anyways, the check in people were so nice. The room was ready. This is cute too. One thing about courtyards, I will say, like, they are up and coming. Like, yes, it is a select hotel brand, but 
they are doing their ish. I need to tell vlog. So, since I've been back, I haven't really done much. Um, I didn't take a shower. I didn't do anything, actually. But that's not true, actually. So, I had gone online for whatever reason and looked up. Why was I online? Why was I looking at jobs? I don't know. I just started looking up jobs for the company I work for, but in New York. <laughs> why is my job? I mean, I do know why, because it costs more to live in New York. But the fact that literally it's 38, the pay range was 28 to 38 dollars for a position that I am fluent in. Seventeen dollars an hour. I applied. I applied, and I'm like, I was supposed to. Oh, and I had to tell you guys. So I I texted um, Irene yesterday because she, I didn't get anything back from her. And I was a little nervous that like she was just being nice, but she didn't actually want to give me the job. Let me just hold this because I. So I texted her back yesterday. She was like, Yeah, um, like, I'm gonna hit you back up when I get a training schedule. Da 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 da. <laughs> I was like, Be Great. But oh my goodness, you guys! Literally, sorry, I'm trying to order food right now because I'm hungry. So I'm gonna order like those pizza notes, those new pizza notes from Pizza Hut, and then just walk over there. It's like 15 minute walk. But <laughs> literally, I could. So I did the math after taxes, minimum because like I kind of lowballed the server job, minimum six figures six which i get you need that to live in new york but i could, the fact that i could make six figures and still like live my life travel because i could i've already got about i i planned this whole thing out and not only that i emailed the guy sorry the fan is going off in there and it's annoying me i emailed the um <laughs> The hiring manager because i didn't want to be glanced over just because i live in atlanta so i emailed him <laughs> and basically told him like hi me but anyways i um i'm like i could work at the hotel obviously it's based off of when they need me hope so hopefully they only need me uh, mainly mornings but anyways i could work thursday night Friday morning, Saturday morning, Sunday morning, because I do the server thing in the evening, Saturdays and Sundays. Monday morning, be off Tuesday and Wednesday. How about a flight Monday afternoon? Go travel out the country to another city, blase blase. Come back Thursday morning. Like, I could continue. I could continue to live my same exact life that I'm living now, just in New York. I, so I emailed him I gave him my number so hopefully they text me because I don't really check my work email like that especially when I'm not at work but yeah I'm very excited um <sighs> I'll keep you guys updated I, didn't, I was like who am I gonna tell literally because I don't like telling people things before they happen um so I'm like let me tell you guys <laughs> Because it's different. It's different. Our relationship is different. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to go finish ordering the pizza. And I'll keep y'all updated. I'm probably going to leave y'all here while I go get the pizza. Just because I'm trying to be in and out. But I'm going to come back. And then I really will wash my hair, flat iron it, and like get ready for the day. Because I have that meeting at 6. I mean, it's like hours away. And I could do my hair. It's 4 hours away I can do my hair during the meeting. But anyways, I'll see you guys later. But that's really exciting, and I just had to share vlogmas is turning up. If I live in, if I somehow manage to, which I know is not possible because like I'd have to find a flight. It'd be a while. But if I just somehow manage to move to New York City by the end of vlogmas, I freaking conic. I conic. I don't care what they say. Anyways, okay, I'm gonna go now. I'll see y'all later. Bye. I'm back. <sighs> you are currently sitting on top of a water bottle. 
And then I just purchased from the gift shop because I was so thirsty. I was so thirsty. But it's 6.13. So I have this meeting in like 15 minutes. I'm so tired. But I just like, I took a nap. Washed and drip blow dried my hair. About to start flat ironing. Um, it's cold in here. <laughs> and yeah, I still haven't heard anything back. I realize now that I've emailed this person before because uh, there was a few weeks ago I was like emailing people about task forcing at their property. So I emailed them about that and then yeah, they never they never responded. So this is me emailing them again. Hopefully they just don't see the first email. I don't know. Hope I uh, hopefully they see the second email. That's really all I care about. I just hope they see the second email. But yeah, so I'm gonna start flat ironing my hair, get this meeting done, and then head over to Zachary's for the challenge night. I'm still low key waking up. And do you hear I'm stuffy? You know what? I, why I think I'm freaking stuffy? There could be like a couple reasons so I really shouldn't just explain this, but a few people have been coming to work sick. It's pissing me off. We need to start paying these people to stay home if they're sick. I don't understand why people have to be forced to come to work when they're sick. Cause now I'm stuffy. And I didn't do nothing. So, hopefully this passes, but for now, we just don't be a little stuffy. What'd you do today? Took a nap. I love that for you. I know. It lasted longer than it was supposed to. Mm -hmm. Like, I was supposed to be done with my hair by now, but I would not get out of the bed until like 5 o'clock. I was so tired. Like, I really want to do weekly vlogs. And maybe I'm in Dubai, or maybe I'm just at the Kroger. Stay tuned to find out. <laughs> okay, so what are your sub-focuses like? Okay, I finished my hair. I did immediately wrap it up because I'm about to go outside. It don't even really look all that, to be honest. So y'all are not missing much. But I'm about to go to Zachary's house. Got this brown top from Zara. I think these jeans are from Urban Outfitters, the BG collection or whatever. Jordans, my mom's Howard hoodie. Just gonna keep the hood on so nobody knows more scarf. I'm gonna head out. The meeting was successful. And so the guy didn't like email me back or anything about the that $30, $38 job in New York, but somebody else emailed me back why well, I had just applied to this data entry sales job. And they emailed me back. And I have an interview tomorrow. So that one, the pay range was like 18 to 20. But it's remote. And I mean, moving to New York was never something that I was like, I mean, it's always like a dream, but not something I was planning on doing tomorrow. It would have just been escalated if I got that one job. But this is pretty cool too, going to remote. And you'll have to be with the job for six months before you can transfer. So maybe in six months we'll be in New York. Or maybe the people will email me back. To, ooh, or maybe the people will email me back tomorrow. Or maybe they'll just call me. We'll see the vibes. But for now, I'm going to head out. Hopefully it's not still hot outside. Because I'm wearing this big jacket. And earlier I was wearing it and it was hot outside. And I sweat a lot. So I'll see y'all on the road. I have arrived at my destination. I have a headache, but I have arrived, so I'm just going to drink some water. I just realized like I didn't post anything today, um, so um, we'll figure that out. Maybe I'll just post two videos tomorrow. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. It's been like a long day, but a short day at the same time. But not to worry, because Vlogmas will continue. It was literally only day seven. <laughs> we got a long way to go. I was supposed to edit so many videos today because I was off. Wow, this is hilarious. All right.